Time now is 547 and time to get an update on that forecast. Here again is meteorologist Vanessa Alonzo. Vanessa. Thanks a lot, Eric, and good morning to you. Well, we had to deal with Cristobal yesterday. Now that system has pushed off into the Missouri Ozarks and will be leaving its mark heading into the Midwest and into the Great Lakes region today. For us, we're just dealing with a few heavy rain showers this morning. We've been dealing with it throughout the overnight hours into early this morning. Now most of it has been confined into Grenada, Yalabusha, and Lafayette counties. So Oxford into New Albany and into Ripley, Boonville, and near the Mississippi, Tennessee state line, you will be dealing with these heavy downpours heading into the next hour or so and then once that round pushes through we'll get a little bit of a break and then we'll see scattered showers and thunderstorms heading into the afternoon and into the evening hours as we get the daytime heating currently overcast skies overlooking downtown columbus downtown tupelo and louisville mississippi on our durns Pharmacy camera in Vernon, Alabama, cloudy skies as well. So the Alpha Insurance SkyCam network is picking up cloudy conditions after we had some heavy downpours yesterday that left anywhere from about an inch to about two inches in some spots. So this morning, we are also waking up to very mild, humid conditions out there in the 70s. Dew points are in the 70s as well, so it's already feeling muggy and kind of icky out there. So you know we are in for quite a warm, humid summer day once again here in North Mississippi and West Alabama. As you can see, the remnants of crystal ball moving up to our north and into our east. And now we are watching this cold front moving into the central plains this morning. This will be pushing through over the next 24 hours and actually it's going to give us some very nice pleasant weather heading into the second half of the week and into the weekend but many of you will need to stay hydrated today like cooper our fur cast pet for today your pets will need to be hydrated as well and drink lots of water as temperatures will be topping out in the upper 80s to near the 90 degree mark, but with the humidity levels and with the dew point levels so high, the heat index will make it feel like the mid to upper 90s out there. So make sure you stay cool and the warm and humid conditions along with the daytime heating will allow once again for those pop up showers and thunderstorms heading into the afternoon. And then we could be dealing with it heading into tomorrow morning as this cold front pushes through. So as you can see, a very warm, humid day for us overall here with those pop up showers and thunderstorms for your Tuesday afternoon and then this cold front will push through overnight into early tomorrow morning and then once this cold front pushes through after midday we are in for a very less humid pleasant and sunny and dry second half of the week and weekend ahead for us Eric. Thanks Vanessa.